Hi, Rich Karuba for BowlingBall.com. You know, we talk about all kinds of ball companies and different bowling balls on videos and our articles at BowlingBall.com, but I think it's important to spend a little time about the 900 global bowling balls and how to find them. Uh, you know, we have them, all the information right at our site, so uh, you want to get real familiar with our site, you can click on the Bowling Balls button on the home page. It'll take you to where you need to go and you'll find the 900 uh, global bowling ball series available to you. But what's important about them is that they've, they've really worked hard the last few years to catch the industry in uh, matching a variety of lane conditions. They have cover stocks to do that. They have some creative engineering uh, core designs to match with the cover stocks and produce the overall ball motion that uh, bowlers around the country are asking to have available to them so when they build their equipment arsenals they can make some choices. Now let's talk about it specifically. Um, the, the 900 Global Bank Pearl uh, is one of the choices. For example, it features an S74 polished shell, has a self-writing core. They talk about it creating a strong and controllable skid flip motion down the lane. People like to see that long skid uh, and then that strong angular back end motion from the break point. It's not really good on heavy oil, maybe when the medium dry uh, conditions when the lanes are breaking down and you got to get a wider angle, make your alignment adjustment to the a wider angle to the break point, you need enough stored energy to come home. That's when the 900 uh, Global Bank Pearl Ball uh, does its thing for you. Now they also have a, uh, another ball called the Favorite. It's a it's a basically uh, it's a it's a medium heavy lane condition ball. Also, it's a reactive cover stock. Uh, it has a uh, 2,000 grit. Uh, texture finish and then the symmetric core gives you that smooth even stable roll pattern and uh, with revs early on the front end yet reacts smoothly at the mid lane with a controllable arc from the break point. So that ball is very popular because you can read the lane well with it. It doesn't do any surprises or tricks. You get a little bit more challenging condition. It's a good ball. Uh, for very heavy oil conditions you could go to the 900 Global Raw Profit bowling ball. It really takes a back seat to no other ball. The solid reactive cover with a symmetric core gives it quick revs in the front end, has that low RG to augment that revs in the front end. Uh, also, uh, it, that's what fights the heavy oil, but it's finished with a 400 grit texture to give you enough smooth smoothness to glide easily and reacts strongly in the mid lane. So the, so the heavy oil doesn't overskid the ball. And because of the high differential rating, you'll still see a very strong back end uh, reaction down the lane. And finally, the long shot, the 900 Global Long Shot Ball. Well, it performs as it's advertised. You get long skid, works well in medium oil, has a very angular back end motion again from the break point to the pocket. It's polished, conserves energy until you need it at the back end of the lane. It transitions smoothly because it has a symmetrical core. If it had an asymmetrical core, then it would probably pull very long and be only good on dry back ends. The manufacturers are smart. They're trying to make controllable motions and yet give you this length potential and the hook potential, uh, let's say, options or choices for you in all these bowling balls. Well, anyway, 900 Global's done a good job with all that. We hope you give it some consideration next time you want to add a ball to your arsenal. And I hope some of this information today helps you. Uh, thanks for taking time to stop by, and uh, we appreciate it. Get out to the lanes and practice.